Hi guys and welcome to Food Review UK. My name is Nathan Pizza. I'm wearing a Yoda hat. Today I'm going to be reviewing uh, this little bad boy. You've already seen a thumbnail of it, but I'm going to show you it again. Crooked Alcoholic Soda, uh, Mother Moon, Peach and Pomegranate. Long-standing watchers of the channel will know that I love an alcoholic brew which is sweet and fruity. Um, or like women. This obviously jumped off the shelf because look at that packaging. That's some crazy shit. Uh, there is actually a second can of this, or certainly I picked up a second can, there may be more, um, which I think is raspberry and lime. As I say, this is peach and pomegranate, which was probably my... L the pomegranate was probably my least favourite of the four fruits involved. Excuse me while I itch my eye. I think this was about one fifty or £2, so fairly pricey considering it's just a can, but at the same time it's alcohol. It's always going to be a bit more pricey, isn't it? So, good one. I've had this a couple of weeks, a few weeks, been itching to review it. I do apologise, I've got a new phone, I'm recording from my phone, and the, the image stabilisation keeps... I don't know how to switch it off. Fuck this. Anyway. Hashtag waft. Smells gorgeous. As I guess we probably would have expected. We've got sort of an amber, a pinky amber colour to it. Very fizzy. Look at that. A lot of the old peach coming through. I'm just about to record um, episode three of uh, Fruck Unwrapped. If you haven't watched uh, or listened to the podcast, uh, episode one and two, I'm rambling. But if you haven't listened to episode one and two of the podcast, please go back and check them out. Um, good times. This is episode three. I needed a bit of Dutch courage because I'm going to be reviewing some anchovies, which sounds disgusting. Anyway, you don't care about that. You care about this. Oh, not quite as... Sweet as I was expecting it going, going to be. I thought this was going to be sort of a very much uh, WKD-esque uh, levels of sweetness and flavour. Obviously it has some elements of it because it's fruity. It's actually quite dry. I guess if I had to sort of try and explain it, it's very similar to flavoured water. You know like you get the flavoured water which isn't fully impactful, full of flavour. It's kind of like that but probably taken up a notch or two. So it's not like a full... Let's put it this way, if you're, if you're buying a virgin peach soda, you'd want it to be quite sweet and whatever. This is just not up there. Which I'll admit is mildly disappointing. It's not bad. It's just a little bit dry. There's a bit of an odd aftertaste, quite a bitter aftertaste, which may be the pomegranate. Yeah, not entirely sure about that. Alcohol percentage 4.7% for those of you that care about that. So, this is more to have a good time than get yourself fucking noshed off. That's not an expression for drunkness, but you know what I'm saying. A little disappointed by that. Probably going to give it still a three stars. Heavy height, three, 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 frisks, three stars. Could be worse, could be a lot better. Yeah, so, thank you all for watching. Uh, have you seen these? If you have, have you tried them? Do you want to try them? Do you like the packaging? Do you like the hat? I don't. Uh, yeah, thank you all for watching. If you've liked this, give us a thumbs up, give us a comment. Have you subscribed to us on Patreon? Please do if you haven't. If you don't, don't worry about it. Bye.